In this video, we will show you how to solve a problem. The Microsoft.ace.oledb.12.0 provider is not registered on the local machine. And this is happened when we're creating application with Microsoft database access in Visual Studio. And if you know, this is happened because not compatible on our computer specification with the application targeting system. And I will show you uh, how this is become error and when we select the target cpu to any cpu with prefer 32-bit jacket in here the application will run smoothly and the question is when we install this application okay because we have done creating setup application in here you can see we have installer the question is when we install this application into the computer client the error will happen look like this because the computer client is not have the specification like the Microsoft Access or Microsoft Office version between 32-bit or 64-bit version. And you can solve this problem by uh, installing the Access Database Engine. Okay, If your computer client is using 64-bit Microsoft Office, just install this version of Access Database Engine. So, uh, the application can communicate with your programs. And if your computer client have 32-bit version, you can install the Access Database Engine with 32-bit version here. You can get uh, all of this Access Database Engine, the link I put into the comment. Okay, so uh, the first solution, you can try to targeting CPU with any CPU or prefer 32-bit if you run smoothly into your computer client so your problem is done but uh, usually the error happen when your computer client has only 64-bit version like uh, Windows 11 in the newest version all application usually prefer run on 64-bit and it is is useless when you Take the prefer 32 bit because your computer client just only 64 bit version. Okay, you understand what I say, and the solution is you install the Access Database Engine. If your computer client has only 64 bit, when your program ticket into prefer 32 bit, still can communicate if you install this Access Database Engine, and I hope this is uh, help you because I already implement this method and it works because I already reading into Microsoft website. Hope this video is helpful for you.